looking back on Saturday, what was what was your biggest takeaway about how you guys performed on the defensive side of the ball and also some of the third down woes that you suffered through? Uh, we made some mistakes and we had some, some things out there on the field, but we're, we're, um, we're, we're learning from our mistakes and we're going to do better from here on forward and just get ready for Clemson. You're a guy that's obviously learning on the field as you're playing more and more. What was your individual takeaway from Saturday? What you did well, what you didn't do well? Um, well, I have made some mistakes on the field and like I left some things out there on the field. So what I'm going to do forward is just get, get better in the film room, get some extra work in, and just learn from my mistakes because, you know, I'm still growing. It's like uh, really my first time, you know, getting like playing time inside the game. So just as I get more playing time and more experience, I'm just going to get better. Were the mistakes because of communication, being out of position? What would you attribute the mistakes to? Um, probably, uh, probably just, just me, just me being out of position. But it's going to be better. I'm going to be better. There's certain keys you're, you know, you look for. Uh, to keep yourself in position. Um, like what you mean by that? Well, I mean uh, by formation and personal uh, movement on the field. Yeah, well, I'm looking at the formation. I'm looking at what the running back do, what the lineman do. As a lineback, you got to look, look at it, like a lot of things. You got to make the communication, the adjustment. So, like in that moment, I just got to stay focused and just dial in, so I can read my keys better. Because it's just, it's just a lot, but yeah. What stands out about Clemson as you're watching them on film and studying what they do offensively? Um, they run like a lot of counter. While offense runs counter a lot, so like I feel like we're gonna be prepared for that. They run a lot of split zone, inside zone, and uh, a lot of switch routes and like uh, like the back flares a lot. Like they really want to get number one the ball. Number two is like a good quarterback. He, like he can run and pass, so we're just gonna have to be ready. And they got like a good offensive line, so we just gotta prepare for all that. I think you mentioned Will Shipley when you were talking about good players for them. What do they do with him as far as trying to match him up on you guys on the linebackers? Uh, like they flare him out, they motion him out. Like they just really try to get him the ball, tosses, uh, counter. He's running behind the offensive lineman. So they're just really trying to get him the ball. And then you got number seven, they're trying to make him run in between the tackles. So we just really got to fit up, make sure um, everybody's in their gap, everybody's in their run fist. And we'll be good. Uh, you know, we really just want to learn from our mistakes last year and learn from our mistakes this season and just fix them this game and just give them our all. That's really, that's really it. Um, it's really all the same thing, but like uh, with the, we're watching TCU film too because he, come, he came from TCU. <laughs> so we're watching TCU film and Clemson film because they they still run in the same place from last year, and we're watching TCU film too to um like be prepared for the plays that can come from them.